Hey guys, this is the Insta360 uh, I just got. Just wanted to show something because uh, I got it shipped. And uh, you can see it looks like the box is kind of banged up a little bit. Yeah, I guess that just must be the what you get from shipping from across the world. Came from China. But uh, yeah, I'm really excited for this one. Just try to open this one here. There's no like flaps or anything on where to really open it from, so I'm just going for wherever here. I did order some extra accessories there so not really a way for you to just open it very easily you have to actually like pull it apart it took about a week to get it from China to California so let's see here's the camera I got two um, uh, cards, about some extra ones. Uh, I got the lens guard, the lens cap, protect the lenses. Uh, let's see, battery, I believe I got two, two extra ones. Because there should be one already with the actual camera, so that should be three in total. And it's uh, that's why I also got this uh, fast charger here. It takes three, charges three at a time. I didn't want to charge it inside the camera because then that heats it up and everything. Well, uh, usually that's what happens. Um, I don't know about this because I haven't tried it before, but usually when you heat things up, charge things up in the actual device, it kind of start deteriorating the circuits inside and then this is the selfie stick it says it's tripod and selfie stick so yeah so yeah the one thing i just wanted to show is just that you know when i got the box it kind of came up pretty beat up so and, you know that's just the the whole dynamics of shipping so yeah there wasn't really any you know, not even really too much padding inside except for this small little thing, you know, to take any impact. And um, that matters a lot. I used to work in shipping a lot and putting bubble wrap around things to help the impact because they just throw packages around. That really matters. So I'm kind of surprised I didn't have that because these things, we want these things to last for a long time. That's what you buy them for. So what I'm going to do is, I think I got about 10 more minutes where I can open up some stuff here. And of course, I would like to open this one up. So it's, it's the main, main thing right here. Just going to open that up. These are the micro SD cards, I believe they're called. 264 gigabyte ones here that I got. And I think you can get them in different sizes and stuff like that. So it's these two, just got some extra ones. They come in these little cases. Actually wanted to get some individual ones, so 
Um, you can kind of like just save them that way instead of just downloading them each time. I like kind of saving them. So let's see. This comes out like this. Slowly comes out. what I notice right here okay and I don't know if you can see that but there's like a little blue mark right there I don't know what that blue marks from it must be from rubbing on these uh, tabs right here kind of rubbing off on them So here's the device. I'm checking to see if anything's shaking inside because like I said, there wasn't much padding on the shipping around. So, you know, hopefully they did some good drop tests with these things. But yeah, here's the, the device right here. Um, let's see, here's some, there's like a pair of scissors, regular size scissors. This is like the size of what it looks like so I don't know if that can give you some kind of comparison but you know it's kind of small small device so hopefully you get some 3d footage uh, 360 footage out of this Got the cleaning cloth and thing, and cables and stuff. You can kind of see this kind of things in other videos. There's so many unboxing videos. But um, just I'm not professional at this, so I want to just give you guys like just a totally um, novice review kind of thing on opening opening this box. Just a cable here. It's a Type C. I can see right away. It's like for Android. I think the iPhones are coming out with these now. Let's see. Here's like some like oh, I think this is like the bag or something like that. Um, it's like a little carrying bag. So that's cool. A little it was like a nylon carrying bag. So that's good. Um, let's see. Here's the tripod. A selfie stick and it says it's a tripod can't remember exactly what I ordered but yeah okay so I see I think these these come out yeah like that and then I think this thing extends um, Stands or something, but um, I know that these go in somehow. I don't want to mess it up. I gotta look at the instructions, but this is a like a long selfie stick and has a tripod on it and stuff. So that's cool. It kind of just comes out like that. Lens cap the lens uh, lens cards so this goes over the lens that are on there now like this has some kind of carrying case also for this um,
Yeah, so that just came out like that right away. There was, it looks like there was no protection except for this plastic bag. There's no protection for the, the lens part. Um, and I believe how this works is that uh, this just goes over the 360, the lens parts like that, and then you clamp it and it just gives it an ex extra protection for the lens here. So that's what this thing does. But, um, you know, since you're, if I plan on recording with this, so you got to also watch the lens on this, but at least this gives it an extra layer for the actual lens on the device because this you wouldn't be able to replace. So it looks like there's, it, the lens came with a, what is this? Okay, it came with an extra bag, which is interesting. So this is an, a bag for this right here. Says, yeah, you do want to protect that because that is going to be used for when you record. You got a bag for this, and then you got a bag for the 360, which is this. Now, here's the lens cap for when. Um, when the lens guard is not on there, you throw this on there to protect the lens still on the 360 because the 360 is, the lenses on the 360, you won't be able to really replace those. So you wanna try to protect those as much as possible. So this is a lens, the lens guard. That's what I just unboxed right here. Lens cap. This is the lens cap. So it goes right on top of the 360. Yeah, so it just go like right on top like that. This cap right here, lens cap. What I'm noticing though is like the inside is uh, rubbery. It doesn't have any kind of like, um, you know, like a, a microfiber kind of cloth on the inside. So I think that's kind of strange. I would have thought that they would have put some microfiber something on here so that when you put it on, it doesn't scrape the lens. So I don't know. I might have to think about that one. And then this right here is an extra battery. So let me open that one up here. I wanted to get an extra couple batteries actually because um, don't want to lose power when we're out there. extra battery came with a little box came inside a little box so that's cool keep them kind of guarded and then here's the battery So that's cool. I like that it has a little case to it. I'm not sure if I'm putting this back right, but it's not going in right. There it goes. It has to go in a certain way. There it goes. And I believe the Insta also has one. I think I'm supposed to like push down on this. Yep. And there's one. So now I have three total. So that's cool. So 
So that's about it. Got the the battery, extra battery. Got the tripod. Oh, there's actually a selfie stick, and then it, it turns into a tripod. And um, just without reading the instructions, I don't want to push it or anything like that. But I don't see how to put these back to where it needs to go. But it says push here. But yeah, I don't want to yank it or anything like that. So I'm going to have to read the instructions to see how to close it back. Yeah, so, it's, and then the lens guard doesn't have the, doesn't have the, like, microfiber inside. So, kind of curious if I should even put this on top of the actual bare lens. If I'm going to have to modify it or something. So, I really want to try to take care of this thing. And then, um, the actual lens guard. So, I was thinking also with this is that... It might be kind of um, inconvenient to keep putting this on and then putting the lens lens uh, cap and then taking off the guard to put this on. So I don't know. I'm going to have to figure out which one I want to use more often. And that's about it.